A new fellowship given by the Jacksonville Public Education Fund bringing social justice initiatives to schools. It focuses on diversity, inclusion, and education. And a local teacher is the first to benefit. News for Jacksonville's Alita Pringle is joining us now from the newsroom. And Lena, you spoke with this teacher about the opportunity. Sorry, Maya. Your piece isn't working, but good morning, Bruce and Jen. Abby Solano is a dual language teacher at West Riverside Elementary and the inaugural Wolfberg Fellow for Social Justice Education. She says that learning and social justice go hand in hand. Why is this so important to have in schools right now? Um, I think it's something that we've needed for a really long time and the pandemic and everything that's occurred over the summer has just got it to a point where we cannot wait any longer to start focusing on these things. Bringing social justice education to the classroom. Uh, Ms. Solano, you have actually been selected as the inaugural Wolfberg Fellow uh, for uh, social justice and education. So congratulations, Ms. Solano. You can't learn if you are not being treated fairly. You can't learn if you're not represented in the classroom. So learning and social justice go hand in hand. The new fellowship enhances diversity, equity, and inclusion in the classroom. The professional development and a year-long class project rooted in issues surrounding identity and representation. It's almost like writing prompts, but instead of turning in an essay, they would turn in photographs to um, share with me in the class how they see themselves how they represent themselves. So a series of self portraits, but not only their faces, but represent yourself with a still life. What's a food that represents you? What's a image that represents you? So, so that they can start crafting their identity with photos. The next phase for Solano's class project will be for her students to research how they're represented in the media. And Solano, a Latina, says receiving this special surprise was even more special because it happened during Hispanic Heritage Month. You can find out more information about this new fellowship inside this story on newsforjax.com. Reporting live in the newsroom, Lena Pringle, Channel 4, The Local Station.